Patterson announced it's stepping up patrols in the wake of a series of shootings that have really rattled the community there. Yeah, the new strategy is designed around using data to zero in on hotbeds. Lindsay Ramos is live for us in Patterson with the story. That's right, guys. Good evening. Well, the latest move by officials here in Patterson aims to not only crack down on crime, but also strengthen bonds with the community it serves. We are adamant about reducing gun violence. Patterson officials today announced what they call phase one of a new strategy that involves enhancing police presence with a new foot patrol that will zero in on crime and prioritize community relations. You hear, you see, you get to work with the community, you get to know what belongs on the block and doesn't belong on the block. This is good old fashioned police work. Veteran officers will be paired with new recruits for each patrol that will be on the ground between 9 in the morning to 8 at night. The officers on the scene or on the beat um, are approachable, get to know them, um, they'll get to know you. The new strategy comes on the heels of an apparent uptick in daytime shootings across the city. Shooting just last month left six wounded. We started seeing Sunday afternoons yeah. and it was just unheard of. According to Mayor Andre Seo, the city's gun suppression unit has taken more than 50 guns off the street this year alone. The pandemic, he says, is definitely a factor in recent trends. People have been out of work. People, children have been out of school. Just, it creates so much uncertainty, creates an element of chaos. Drugs, guns, gangs are synonymous. They go together and they are part of the problem. Patterson has made strides recently when it comes to policing with its officer body camera program and an independent audit of its police department currently underway. Officials hope their efforts don't go unnoticed. We're always thinking of ways to better service our community. Now, this new program officially kicks off on April 11th. The mayor saying that the upcoming census results will play a huge role in how the city expands its policing initiatives. Uh, an increase in the population will, of course, mean more federal funding flowing into the city. For now, we are live in Patterson. I'm Andrew Ramos, Fix 11 News. All right, Andrew. Thank you. All right. This is the.